DPP-4 inhibitors is a class of oral hypoglycemics. They also known as gliptins. They are prescribed in patients having type 2 diabetes mellitus, who have not responded to drugs such as metformin and sulfonylureas adequately. DPP-4 inhibitors are not only effective in lowering blood glucose levels but they also can help to reduce appetite, so they are beneficial for patients who need to lose weight. Drugs in this class include citagliptin, bildagliptin, etc. Question is that, how DPP-4 inhibitors work? But first of all you should know about glucagon. Glucagon is a peptide hormone, which is produced by alpha cells of pancreas. Glucagon increases blood glucose levels. That is, its effect is opposite to that of insulin, which lowers blood glucose levels. DPP-4 inhibitors reduce glucagon and ultimately blood glucose levels. Actually the mechanism of action of DPP-4 inhibitors is to increase in cretin levels which are GLP-1 also called as glucagon-like peptide 1 and GIP called as gastric inhibitory polypeptide. Glucagon-like peptide 1 and gastric inhibitory polypeptide. Inhibit glucagon release, which in turn increases insulin secretion, decreases gastric emptying, and decreases blood glucose levels. Question is which patients need DPP-4 inhibitors and the answer is DPP-4 inhibitors may be used as a second or third line medication for patients having type 2 diabetes after prescribing metformin and sulfonylureas. That is when metformin and sulfonylureas do not work alone and second agents is required to control blood glucose levels, then we should consider about DPP-4 inhibitors. while talking about adverse effects of DPP-4 inhibitors. DPP-4 inhibitors have been linked with an increased risk of pancreatitis. Remember patients who already taking sulfonylureas, there is an increased risk of hypoglycemia when DPP-4 inhibitors, drug class added. Other adverse effects include nasopharyngitis, headache, nausea, heart failure, hypersensitivity and skin reactions. Citagliptin, saxagliptin, linagliptin, and allagliptin may cause joint pain that can be even severe and disabling. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe our channel for next coming videos.